Welcome back to our message from our Divine Compassionate Guides. Thank you again for joining me. Today I am pulling once again from the Wisdom of Oracle Divination Cards by Colette Barron reed And uh, of course I've pulled on what message our guides would like us to have for today. So let's find out what our message is and get into that deep dive. So with these cards, there is five different meanings. We'll have the Oracle message, the essential meaning, the relationship message, the manifestation, uh, prosperity message, and the protection message. So one, two, three, four, five messages. I am correct. <laughs> so we'll go through those and find out all the messages that our card have for us today. Oh, beautiful. This is our card, why? So as I always recommend, just take a deep breath in, allowing yourself to get settled. And, and centered. And as we exhale, just letting everything go. And with our next breath, we're going to be open to our message, why? Our essential meaning, motives, driving intention, the power of knowing the why. The oracle's message, there is great power in understanding your motives right now. The oracle asks you to be very clear about why you're asking this question. Looking for this answer, behaving in this way, and most important, making this cho choice knowing your why is the key to fulfillment. When you are clear about it, your intention will be a magnet for miracles. Motives define the nature of your experience. When you think about something, feel it, and then act on it. This invisible why is a life force energy holding the seed, which brings it to life and holds the potential for growth. The relationship message. We don't always know why we engage in our relationships in the way we do, mostly because our feelings aren't always logical. Now is the time to re or recognize whether you are being triggered by someone else or if your behavior is motivated by unresolved issues in the past. When you ask yourself, why am I feeling like this? And why did I say that? and spend some time in introspection. And an the answers may be surprising. Listening to the messages from your intuition, from the knowing deep within you, what does it tell you about yourself? And with about yourself and others, in the end, life is about being loved, miracles and the deep understanding of your needs and how to get them met Af are the buried treasures of the why. Uncover them by po Posing the most powerful question you can ask yourself and your partner today. Why? The prosperity message. Knowing the motives behind your career and creative ventures is the ticket to your greatest success. It's time to ask yourself some probing questions. Are you driven by a desire to serve? Does your prosperity impact the greater good? When you envision your most prosperous life, are you guided by a sense of purpose or by a need to make money, acquire things, and save for the future, or all of these. No motive is good or bad, but having agendas hidden from yourself will lead to disappointment and possibly failure. Be, be clear about why you want the things you do. If the motives are true, accept them. If they are not, change them so you can step into your extraordinary life. And then our protection message. Sometimes subconsciously denying the truth may drive you towards a specific outcome that actually aligns with an intention hidden from your awareness. For example, you may want to be prominent, be prominent in your profession, but your desire is not really about sharing your talents, but about making yourself feel better because fame would cause people to admire and approve of you. Or you may want to reunite with a partner who rejected you because you believe that your love continues to be strong, but deep down you really desire it, the, you really desire to have the last word with the person. Now is the time for your deep soul searching of why that drives your choices. That you uncover, what you uncover will set you free and bring you even closer, closer to the happiness you seek. So as you can see today, everything comes back to that deep question of why. Why are we doing what we're doing? Why do we want to create things we want to create? Is it in line with our purpose? Because it's going to be much more in line if we're not holding any hidden agendas to, for ourselves. 
Why are we doing what we do? Why do I get up and do this even if not very many people see these videos? Because I want to learn these cards better. I want to have better skills so I can help people using the cards. And my focus is that I'm helping that even if just one person that watches this gets some clarity, some help, healing, and it serves them in the way that it's meant to, I feel like that has been successful. It's not about the views. It's about helping and healing even on the individual level. So it's a great question to ask yourself today as we go through our life and our automatic movements. Why do we do what we do? So always have a beautiful day. And until tomorrow, namaste.